Hello, everyone. My name is Rick McCutcheon. I'm a Dynamics 365 MVP, and I'm here today with Mike Bolton from Avendica. Mike, introduce yourself and let the people know about your organization. Hi, I'm, I'm Mike Bolton. I'm the president and co-founder of Avendica. Um, we've been a Microsoft partner for 16 years, really about extending the Microsoft business solutions to do uh, online e-commerce. And um, really, that's, that's our art, it's our focus, and it's our practice. You know, and, and it's a, a great place to be, actually, in this world of digital transformation, where every B2C company has kind of got that done, but there's a lot of B2B companies are saying, we've got to bring e-commerce, uh, you know, into our offering. Yeah, you, you imagine the, the, the change of the dynamics of COVID brought in this need for this ability to take your... Um, sales experience and push it and automate it online and, and really provide that both B2B and B2C experience. And it becomes a, a major strategic sort of um, strategy for every company out there. So Mike, you know, when we talk about dynamics, it means different things to different people. So are you with GP, NAV, Business Central, AX, FNO, or CRM, CE? Where does your organization fit from platform? Well, we've sort of grown with the Microsoft business stack, uh, business solution stack. So you imagine we started off in GP and then we went into AX and now our main focus is D365 and providing that amazing e-commerce experience within the cloud. And, and most recently, Microsoft has come out with D365 Commerce and they have their B2C sort of offering. So our team has been sort of um, been in the weeds of that and it's amazing sort of product, leveraging the most modern sort of solutions and, and we built some connectors on, on that platform. And you imagine now in the future, uh, Microsoft's gonna come out with the, their e-commerce B2B offering, which I'm looking at some of those uh, specifications and it's gonna be world-class in the D365 channel. So, you know, your solution, what types of companies do you fit best with? Well, we, we've done a lot of uh, focus onto retail. So you imagine in the B2C world, you have um, companies like um, the, the Vegas Raiders and they sell merchandise, clothing, apparel, and we, we help take those orders and we flow it through their point of sale into D365 and create that amazing sort of digital experience. We've also have a, a big focus on um, beverage, so alcohol beverage. And so if you, if you imagine uh, the state of Ohio or New Hampshire Liquor Commission, they, they need to sell to bars and restaurants, but also into direct consumers. So we help automate that on the Microsoft stack of, of technology. And, and it's, been, it's been pretty great because if you imagine the, the um, breadth and depth of the Microsoft uh, customers, it's, it's been really great for us. So when I retire from partner talks, I'm going to come work for you as a sales rep because I can go talk to sports teams and to liquor, liquor companies. Yes. <laughs> well, we, we, we do have happy, happy employees because of that. <laughs> okay, so it, it's, a, it's a great spot. So when we start talking about retail, we start talking about, um, you know, what Microsoft's doing around with the FNO side of things and the direction they're taking. They're getting a lot of traction with that. So to, what technologies do you see now that you get excited about in the, in the retail space? And what technologies in the future do you plan on really starting to integrate with and be part of? Yeah, and I, I mean, there's some amazing innovations that, because when you start to tie in some IoT into the mix, as well as the, the back end processes inside it, well, online e-commerce, um, we would work very closely with the Microsoft partners and sort of uh, creating some innovations in that space. And so if you imagine someone goes online and they're looking at some specific products, they've downloaded the app for that store, and then they walk into the store. And in the store, there's a digital display and it might show, hey, look, you were looking at men's athletic wear. And we you know, show that particular image as they're walking into the store, what they're doing, because you're creating this relationship in a, in a more sort of holistic omni-channel way. And, and so, and then as they're going through the store, you might, um, you know, as they're checking out, you might give them a, a coupon code and a, and a digital uh, display to say, come back and do a further transaction. So we've really worked on that holistic sort of retail to online to in-store sort of experience um, to create some, some, some interesting innovations. And what do you see sort of in the future that's going to be really exciting around the, that area? Well, it really comes down to loyalty. And so, you know, as every company out there is trying to create that amazing sort of customers and the loyalty, as you take things like we've created connectors for D365 
um, commerce, e-commerce solution for Ribbon or Carlton One. And, and really they're like rewards platforms. And so how do you reward someone for doing some great behavior and for engaging you as, as, as a customer? Well, you might give them like, you know, products, let's say in Carlton One, they have um, 10,000 different products and amazing brands. They, they can give them an iPhone or give them, um, give them some sort of technology. Where Ribbon, what they do is they give gift cards. So here's some actual money that you can go spend on, um, on, on your site. And so we've created connectors to create that customer loyalty and engagement. Um, and then from the in-store experience, you know, if you, you imagine if you come in and you're, you're seeing products that you've liked online and you're, you're told where to go within the store through these digital displays, that becomes very powerful in that sort of customer engagement side of things. Okay, great. So Mike, thanks for your time today. Uh, I appreciate you coming on and talking about sort of what's happening in the retail space with Dynamics and I'll be touching base with you again to get an update of uh, what's what is happening in this sort of uh, exciting sector. Great Rick, thank you very much. It's been a pleasure working with you.